Peaks in the central range of Papua, Indonesia jut to well over 4,000 meters above sea level. The limestone rocks making up the crest of the range are crumpled and broken. This area is a structural geologist's dream. A series of lakes dot the top of the range. One of these, Lake Eidenberg, lies in the shadow of Mount Eidenberg. For years there have been rumors that Lake Eidenberg would occasionally drain itself completely and then refill again. These rumors spurred a group of scientists to investigate this phenomenon. This is the story of the mystery of Lake Eidenberg. An initial visit to the location on May 20, 2007 revealed a beautiful, elongate, turquoise-colored lake full of crystal clear water. At that time, the lake waters were still with no indications of any current. However, a past history of variable lake levels was evident on the valley walls. Of course, this observation alone could not verify the rumors that the lake could drain itself completely, only that the lake level has fluctuated with time. The lake draining rumors remained a myth. A second visit to Lake Eidenberg on June 23, 2007 shocked the investigators. There was no water in the lake at all except for a small, lazy stream that meandered across the muddy floor of the drained lake. The difference in the appearance of the lake compared to the previous month was stunning. Being true scientists, the investigators struck out to study the lake bottom looking for clues to the riddle. Okay, Eidenberg Lake, water draining through it. There's where it comes out. So, the discovery made is that there is a drain hole in the valley bottom. Only the true experts know the mechanism by which this drain hole can periodically be open or closed. Perhaps during a heavy rain event, enough mud washes into the hole blocking it and causing the lake to refill. Later, when the level of the lake rises high enough, the immense pressure of the water in the lake forces the drain back open. If true, the draining of Eidenberg Lake is probably measured in hours rather than weeks. What we do know is that the limestone rocks in the area host voluminous caverns and that on the flanks of the mountains there are places where waterfalls appear on cliff faces with no apparent surface source. This begs the question, are there underground rivers in the central range of Papua, Indonesia?